I didn't pay anything for this school of hard knocks, so it was cheaper. Damn prop. Is it? Yeah. Oh, crap. Nothing I can do about it now. But we gotta get rid of it. I got uh I got rid of that iron still finally. I just got XL monofilament on it now. Yeah, I'm still using it. Yeah, no problem with it. Oh damn. That's different. That's that grassy weed. It's not mm -hmm. val, you know what I mean? Right, I know. It's like that. What's the depth? Three feet? Five. Yeah, countdown might not be the best thing, but the you know, ripples I think it'll be fine. Only because of the uh, lack of strong action. I got a farmer. size bomber right now. Which gives me an idea. Oh, a little bigger minnow jump that time. I'd leave it for a split second before I, I would do it slow, real super slow. It's a snake proof frog. Wow, if you get if you get a fish on that, it's going to be exciting. <laughs> Too bad there's no camera pointing that way, you know? I know, I don't have that on. Thought I had a hit. I, I got one. All right. Oh, man. Get the net quick. I am. Nice. Come on. I'm what? Spinner bait. Where 
was he out? Out more? Yeah, he's pretty close to sure. There he is, little guy. Pound maybe. Yeah, he, he hit it twice. <laughs> he was in a little deeper water. Uh, whatever it is, you know, three feet, two feet. Yeah. It wasn't a lot, it wasn't really deep. But they're here, they're shoreline for sure today, man. I think, I think we can pretty much take that to the bank. But he hit it once, and then he hit it again. It was pretty cool. I don't even have a stinger on there. Well, I was just, normally you don't need it. I look like I'm putting some insurance. Yeah, well, that's me too. But this is the one I put on. I go, oh, this one don't have a stinger, but it produced two fish so far. Mm -hmm. A northern and a smallmouth. And he hit pretty quick. But I was I was bouncing it, you know what I mean? I would let it fall. And then he hit it on the fall. And then I pulled him up and then he, he shook it or didn't get it. And he hit it again. But see, I got one of those gulp minnows on here, too. Mm -hmm. So that might be a little scent. Incentive. Yeah, see? I got one of those yeah. gulps with the tails on it. Damn, look at this shit, though. <laughs> hey, we ought to just fish these shorelines for a while. I mean, I, 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 I caught more fish again with every time. I got old school. Huh? DT16 old school. There he's a little guy. That was a 14, too. When it does, go prove it. And if the water conditions are different, but it still works. Well, it's hit bottom. The 16 is for sure, yeah. hit it on the swing back. You know, when, when it was mm -hmm. coming across and then I pulled it again. Yeah.
scuba grapple as a apologist is the sharpness of the hooks. Mm -hmm. I mean, they don't, they, there's no like cut, corner cuts, you know, like, like, yeah, we'll just use these. And, yeah, this is all right. You know, they just, they, they make sure, you know, they go with the best stuff. Ooh, hit. I got one. Yeah, yeah. Oh wait, no, he shook it. He shook it right there. Yeah. It was a little bit. It was on that swing back every single time. You now it's coming, 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 then it changes direction. And then that's when he hits it. They said they're going to ban this lure. Ban the color and everything. <laughs> Well, I'm trying to see. I got the same style, but different color. Yours is more bright. Mine's more natural. I'm just going to see what the deal is. Well, see, this combines a little bit of orange on the front, you know, and yellow and green. And I had a hit. out of the water bin. A rock bin. Yeah, like a little like the shape of a rock bin. A drum. Didn't I catch a rock bass back at moments? Yeah. Oh, I kept forgetting that I caught that rock bass. Yeah, you caught a rock bass. Yeah. It was, it was more before we, it was in between. Right. And along some kind of shoreline. I know that was a freaking hit, though. Or I hit something. They're more scattered. This is the work again. My wrist was hurt me for two days. Yeah, I know. Especially when you're trying to get it back to the boat. Yeah, exactly. Lifting it, you know. Mm -hmm. Trying to get that thing lifting out of it. Yeah. That's that's where it gets tough. But I just love the fact you cast them so far. Yeah, right. I was going to try an uh, orange. I guess I will, huh? See, this is the worst thing. You get it way out there and you get shit all over it. Yeah. Well, right away, then it's it. I know, and I'm dragging back a fucking salad. Yeah, and then a grass carpet, too. <laughs> it's the 
That's the way you catch grass carp. What's that thing you were saying before about the guy putting all those lures on there? How many did he put on there? He had one of them spreader things. It's like six. <laughs> it's like six lures. Do you think you could pull in six of these? No. If you had no, they're like minnow feeds. Oh, yeah, that's like, oh my god.
preposterously. Oh, got him right at the surface. You know, he hit right as I pulled yeah, up my lure. Okay. Fucker, be still. Small mouth. Oh, he's hooked. Why? His possum is hooked. What you get for shaking like a man? He's on the impossible. Um, so if you got it through the tongue, it's always a tough one. Same size, well, a little bigger than mm -hmm. the other Same fish. <laughs> it could be. He's the only active. He's the only active fish on the river. But I caught him on the when I was ripping. And and you see that? Mm -hmm. I hit it near the surface and he went for it. And there's no way they're near the surface, so he followed that thing all the way. Make sure it's not in gear. 